What up, what up, what up? Hey, look, it's another Let's Play by the B2. We're going to check out a game called Defense Clickers. Now, the developer of this game contacted me on YouTube and said, Hey, B2, what do you think about playing this game? Here's a Steam key with a... What are those things called? A DLC key? Like, check this game out and, you know, let me know what you think. And I'm telling you, like, first first look, it takes me back to when I was in high school or junior high. And I know that I'm a super old dude, but it takes me back to those Nintendo, the original 8-bit days when, like, you'd get a game like Pitfall or something would come up. And, you know, it was, it was just such a simple game, but it was so uh, fun to play. and You could just play for hours. And that's my first impression of this game, not because I got a free key or anything. But it does remind me of uh, BTD, that whole series, the, the tower defense thing. Uh, but I do, I, I like it's, it's It's simple, yet it's still challenging and... And, and the waves and everything that come out. Now, when you first load up, it's confusing. There's a lot going on on the screen. There's no tutorial. So you're just kind of like, okay, well, I've played tower defense games like this. So let me try and figure this out. Um, and I figured out probably about 80 or 90% of the game within the first hour. Uh, as far as learning the menus and how they work and what does what, it's a little bit confusing. So what I'm going to do is spend a few minutes. I'm going to walk you through all the way um, through the different menus. And then we're going to take a look at the actual game. Now, there's music and there's sound, but it's like, whoa, when you turn it on. There's no slider uh, to you know, calm the music or the sounds down, so I prefer to play with the sounds off. Not a big deal, right? Um, there's different music, though. We can go smooth. We can go 80th element. Okay, there it goes. Oh, we can go rock. I'm going to go none. So uh, that's that settings menu. The build mode's cool. You can see what you have up here. Um, and you can just kind of look and then choose what you want to build. Arrow, sniper. But see the backgrounds on here? They do need to be a little bit more prominent, I think, because they're kind of hard to see, especially um, some, of the, some of the lower ones on there. But, um, you know, here's what I would say is, is look in the strategy mode and it will show you what the backgrounds are. No attack, ground only, whatever. The no attack is like the farmer. Um, even even the speeders have uh, attack on them. They're not very. They don't attack very hardcore. They're really to speed up the other the attack on the other towers. So. Um but then when you go into build mode, you can see Stomper is is ground and Chain is air, and those are going to be your main units. Now, I did turn and put a ring here, and then, uh, you know, I put uh, a sniper here because I'm thinking, you know, some of the other uh, tower defense style games. But honestly, like, all you're going to need is Stompers and Chains and a few arrows in here. And, uh, and you know, everyone's going to have their different style, their way of getting it done. Um and so, like, I put the arrows at the end because as the guys, if they can make it through the stompers over here, and I'm going to add more stompers, then they're going to need to be shorted out with some arrows in this, starting in this area, because some of them, you know, in the beginning, like, look, you can't even see them coming out. They're just, they're just handled. Now, if I went on rage mode here, they go faster, and that's how, how you speed up the levels. So let's say you get to, like, level 20, and you lose all your lives, which means all the characters get from this side, and 15 of them make it in the door over here. Then you reset it wave one and you start over again and you keep part of your money but what you're trying to do is you're trying to save up enough money for your next upgrade and in build mode it'll show you once you click on the ring I need um, 102,500 to get my next unit to place right so that's just kind of how you watch your money from that side now strategy mode is going to show you like um, your tower data on all the different stuff here it's a stomper it's a stomper it's an arrow level seven you know which uh, which yeah, as you level up I'm going to show you the tower upgrades here now, all the ones with plus marks are ones that you can upgrade. And you can see it says Prime at the bottom. And here's your Prime right here. So that's kind of how you know you can upgrade. So let's say you wanted to upgrade the Stomper damage. Bang! It can go up and you upgraded the Stomper damage. What about the range? Bang! You updated the range. You know, So it's kind of just how it how it is. We can upgrade some Sniper damage and we're out. Now the top says 85GC, 85RC, and that corresponds to red crystals, blue crystals, green crystals, teal crystals, you know. No, that's just how that is. When you fill them up to the max, you're able to upgrade them to a new max. Same with gold. If I was to get 205,000 gold, I could bang that, and then the total gold you can store will go up. I haven't really needed to store any more than that because my highest upgrade is 102,500 now, so I'll be able to get that with no problem. Uh, these 
upgrade really quick and this is kind of a cool thing like click damage right like let's say i wanted to help out and there were some guys getting close to the end i could i could click on those and get them out and sit here and click Brrr, see i'm doing six click damage because i haven't upgraded that you guys know me i'm not a very active clicker let's say you're getting swarmed by stuff and you're like oh no i'm gonna lose you can click on your heroes here and they start shooting out like more hardcore stuff but see my wave got through and killed me i was on rage mode and i should have stopped and put it back on normal but that's pretty much how it goes now i reset to level one i keep partial amounts of the gold and the quest starts again so we're going to hit rage mode and try to go up to like level 10 uh, just to get moving at it again. So tower upgrades, you kind of know how to handle. Handle. We'll get some ring damage. Um, Evo upgrades. I haven't done an Evo yet, so I don't. I can't speak to that. If you have done an Evo, hit me up in the comments. Let us know what it looks like, and uh, and we'll we'll kind of add to that on the Evo comments. Um, if I look, continuing down the list, heroes and pets, uh, when I get enough PE or FE, which is over here, um, then you can upgrade your pets. And so like clicking on that, on this mode, if you look here for the FE, if I click to use him, it's going to use 10 FE, and therefore I'm not accumulating anymore. But look at the stream that's just coming steady out of this fire uh, while he's burning there. See? So uh, boom, and then he resets and he goes back to his normal rate of fire. Uh, no big deal. And then your pet, where is he at? He's right here collecting all the crystals down here and down here all that stuff comes from the kills so you end up with that if you want to go into settings we've seen that you can click on the different buttons um, rate reset it would take me back to wave one I don't want to do that because I want to start accumulating money rage mode you know what that does evolution I'm not at the evolution point so I can't speak to that we're gonna set normal mode back on um, information will show you how much you've killed data enemy hit points and green lizards and demons and boss kills and stuff like that so it kind of keeps a goofy track of it but i, I kind of dig it man it's a it's a very cool game it's not like um uh super super graphics intense yet it's in the early stages but it's a two dollar game that uh, that we can play i'm going to go ahead on my discord as well i'll put that in the comment section if you guys want to join the discord i'll make a defense clicker channel to share information um, post screenshots and do that sort of stuff and and i'll have the invite in the comments as well to there um as far as jobs go um, you have to get to level 50 to get another um, job basically and I don't know what that's gonna be because again I haven't hit level 50 so then the talents this allows you to upgrade um, and you'll have available points as one and I need uh, three to upgrade this anyway I upgraded sniper and arrow damage uh, didn't make a huge difference but any bonus damage to me is welcomed for sure so uh, if you have any questions or comments about defense clicker go ahead and hit me up but uh, again Again, it's a let's play by the B2 for defense clickers. Have a great night, guys. See ya.